What is good everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today I do have some custom WWE figure championship belts for you guys. Yes, we do have the brand new Hemp WWE Championship right here on Daniel Bryan. The new Daniel Bryan or whatever you want to call him here. Um, I do have it sort of uh, banded down right there with one of those things that comes in the Mattel packaging. But you guys can see right here we do have the Hemp WWE Championship. Very, very easy to make, honestly, guys. I mean, you could easily make this yourselves. I did make two different versions, but I felt like this one came out a little bit better. Even though this one's even slightly lower. Yeah, I just, I think the spacing and everything works better for this one. I made this one with bigger images, like slightly bigger. I, I had trouble sort of printing off, you know, the exact size that I needed. But uh, anyways... Done with that one. Let's use this one that is more accurate. It looks a lot better. All I did really was I took this stuff right here. I got this from Walmart and I cut it to size. I used the WWE Championship strap that Mattel gives us. I, you know, placed it on there, cut out the shape of the strap. And from there, I took one of those gold chase belts. Let me go ahead and get it right here. I had an extra gold chase belt. You remember the ones that used to come with the basic figures? And I cut out the center plate. I put it over uh, some of this foam back here. So I got this foam. This is all from Walmart, pretty much. I, I'm pretty sure I got all of this from Walmart. I took this right here. I put the plate over it. Took my scissors, cut out that image, uh, or that uh, that exact shape there of the middle plate. I then uh, glued that to the middle, and you know, so that way you have that little foam piece there. Gives it a little uh, three dimensional. You know, gives it some spacing off of the strap. And then I printed off an image of the WWE Championship, the new one that Daniel Bryan obviously debuted. And then I glued it to that piece, and then everything was good. And did the same thing with the side plates. Cut the side plates from that same Golden Chase uh, Championship. So I did the same thing with the side plates, and then I did the same thing even with those little gold dividers that go on those championships. And then I just glued everything to the strap, and then voila, you have the brand new Hemp WWE Championship. The only thing that sucks is the back of it is white. This is tape. Like, if you were to peel this off, it would be sticky, so I could, I guess, stick it to something if I wanted. But honestly, that would be pretty freaking stupid, right? So uh, I'm just going to leave that on there. It doesn't hinder anything. You can't even see it on the front. And I think it worked out pretty well. I'm pretty happy for it or with it, and it looks good on the WWE Champion Daniel Bryan. So we do have the Hemp WWE Championship. I, I, I was really happy with the way it came out. And that's pretty much it on how you make the WWE Championship. Again, I got all of this from Walmart just on their little fabric or craft section, and it was very easy process. Process. I literally made that in like five to ten minutes. I did it while I was just eating dinner, just sitting there snippity snap, glutity glue, and McGlasses, McGasses, and bam, had a WWE championship. And another thing that we got, guys, are these two beautiful custom made WWE Women's Tag Team Championships. And these are made by my boy Last Smith on Instagram. Um, you guys can go follow him. He is an amazing custom belt maker. You guys can actually order these from him. He handcrafts every single championship belt, and we're going to take a look at them here as I get them out of their baggies. I am super duper impressed with these. I removed them earlier, but I wanted to, you know, put them back in the bag for the video here. But we're going to take a zoom in shot. Look at how wonderful these tag titles look, guys. And, of course, you know we're going to put them on the, the figures themselves. But look at all the detail we got going on. I want to make sure you guys can get in here and see this. So you guys can see it is on this thin strap. This is real leather. It, it has Velcro on it. This is uh, metal. This is actually metal plates. He, he literally hand engraves everything. You can see it says tag team in the middle there. You got the WWE. WWE logo. You have the shape of the title and everything. It's literally perfect. I love this. I think it looks so realistic. You know, none of it's plastic. It's all legit. It, it, it looks amazing. And Last does an amazing job on this. Um, here's the back of it. You guys can literally see it's real leather. It's all high quality made stuff. You can go order these. If you would like a set of these tag titles yourselves, guys, go over to his Instagram page and definitely follow him and check out some of his work. He has plenty of other belts for uh, purchase as well. So if you guys would like some other ones of those or you want a set of women's tag team titles for your collection, then this is definitely where you want to go, guys. Best looking tag titles I've seen. I mean, I don't, I don't, uh, this is much better than, you know, just the images printed on there. This is official. This looks great. And it looks great on the figure. So why not? Go ahead and add them to who I think should win at the Elimination Chamber pay-per-view. I'm going to go ahead and Velcro it right here. That way I can stick it on the ladies themselves. We got Bailey right here, and Bailey's going to win because if, I swear to God, guys, if Sasha Banks and Bailey do not win these Women's Tag Team Championships at Elimination Chamber and they go with, you know, Nia Jax or Tamina, 
or any other team, literally, if it's not Sasha Banks and Bailey, then that, I think that's going to be a huge mistake. I think that would be a really, really dumb mistake on WWE's part, and literally no one else should walk out of there than Sasha Banks and Bailey. They should walk out as first ever women's tag team champions. They deserve it. You know, after the 2017 um, that they had, and then the 2018 that was absolutely trash. Uh, these girls, these women deserve this, and they should totally walk out of the Elimination Chamber with these tag titles, and these look great, guys. Again, Lash Smith on Instagram, I love these titles. I think they look great. They look great on the figures, a lot better than the Intercontinental Championships I was using in our little action figure setup. So I will be using these going forward, and uh, you know it's going to be a freaking minute. It's going to be a long time before Mattel gives them to us. So if you guys would like to purchase these, I would definitely say go over there. I'll even leave a link in the description to his Instagram page where you guys can go follow him. And you guys can hit him up, get an order of these yourselves, and really good prices, really fast shipping, and he's just a beast of a dude. Thank you so much, bro, for the epic belts. I think they look incredible again. Mattel is going to take forever to get these out, guys. It's going to be at least six to eight months, probably, probably literally by fall or December of Christmas is when we'll probably get these from Mattel. So if you guys want to pick these titles up, you definitely need to go over there and do that, guys. But that pretty much does it for today's video. We had Bailey, we had Sasha, we had Daniel Bryan. So not only did we get the women's tag titles, but we also had the brand new WWE Championship in the hemp form from the new heel Daniel Bryan. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you guys uh, would like to create this belt yourself, send me a DM on, Inst on Instagram. I would love to know what it looks like, how you guys went about it. Did you do something different? But that pretty much does it for today's video, guys. Thank you so very much for watching. Another thing, guys, yesterday MDT Live was posted. If you guys want to go check that out, definitely go check it out. We are grinding near and near to MDT Royal Rumble. We just completed MDT Live episode 11, so we have one more episode of Vindication, one more episode of MDT Live, and it will be MDT Royal Rumble time, and it's going to be epic as crap. It's going to be great stuff, so definitely check out episode 11 if you did miss it. We also had some Elimination Chamber videos go up for the past few days. Definitely go check those out. Predictions, setups, all kinds of great stuff on the channel. Go check it out. Subscribe to the channel for more epic WWE figure videos. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at MyDamnToys, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.